Thank you for joining me. Right below this video, you can click like, share, subscribe. If you want to make a financial contribution or become a monthly financial contributor to this YouTube channel, down in the comment section, you can click on my Patreon page. You can also reach out to me through my email address. In what is called the Sermon on the Mount, Jesus said something that we call the golden rule. It's Matthew chapter 7, verse 12. He simply says, in everything, treat other people the way you want to be treated. For this summarizes the law and the prophets. So yesterday, I was going to get the mail in our apartment complex, which means I was walking on the sidewalk toward the office building. That's where the mail room is. And I noticed a woman putting a piece of paper on the windshield of our vehicle. She's somebody that we know. I've talked to her and her husband occasionally. They're a young couple. They have a three-year-old and a four-year-old, and she is great with child number three. Uh, they're, a, they're a beautiful couple. So I'm going to get the mail, and she's putting a note on our windshield, under the windshield wiper, and she sees me, and she's just nervous, really, really shaking, disturbed, and I smile and said, what's going on? And I, I reached for the note and she said, I hit your car. Well, it turns out she had been grocery shopping with the three-year-old and the four-year-old and the, the one yet to be born. And when she went to park, the front of her car hit the back of our car. Um, I went, I looked, and what she had hit was actually a rubber bumper kind of contraption. I think cars are basically made out of rubber and plastic these days, but maybe I'm wrong. Um, I was actually able to, to wipe and, and buff it out, so it was no big deal. But the very big deal was what she did. Now think about it. Put, it, put yourself in her place. Uh, you have a three-year-old, you have a four-year-old, you have a car full of groceries, you're maybe eight months pregnant, and you hit another car. But it's not terribly damage the path of least resistance is just to pretend it didn't happen because nobody saw it. You would think in an apartment complex, but nobody saw it. Here she is treating other people the way she would want to be treated. Um, I talked to her and, 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 said it is okay and I helped her get the kids and the groceries into her apartment. Um, I've been in communication with her husband and it's just not a big deal. She's so young. I could be her dad. I could be her grandfather probably. But she took me to school yesterday and she taught me what it looks like to go golden ruling. And I'm so proud of her for doing that. Treat other people in everything, in everything. Treat other people the way you want to be treated. Jesus says, this sums up the entirety of the Hebrew scriptures. Can it be that simple? No, nah, it's not simple. It's, it can be very, very difficult 
to treat other people the way we want to be treated. Sometimes it's inconvenient. Sometimes it's unpleasant. But it works if you work it. So here's my proposal. Let's change the world. Or at least the little space we occupy on the planet. Whenever we know we're going to be interacting with other people, let's go golden ruling. Let's, in everything, treat other people the way we want to be treated. In Jesus' name, amen. Grace and peace.